So ABA is uh, short for Applied Behavior Analysis, and this is a technique uh, that's based on learning theory, and <coughs> it has two aims. One is to teach skills, and the other is to try to work on problem behaviors or interfering behaviors. So the interfering behaviors might include avoidance of eye contact, um, sort of obsessive interests about strange things, um, sensory self-stimulation, like this kind of thing. Um, and that can really interfere with developing social relationships and with learning from the environment. So there are, uh, and then there are other problem behaviors, of course, like aggression um, or property destruction or refusing to do what an adult is asking. Um, and those things can be targeted with things like planned ignoring, reinforcing alternative uh, ways of expressing it. Um, so there are a whole variety of behavioral techniques to try to really reduce these interfering behaviors. And then the other big main thrust of ABA is to teach skills that the children are not learning the way typically developing children are learning just naturally from the environment. So if you have a three-year-old child with autism who is not yet speaking, just giving them normal language input has not been sufficient to trigger their language learning. So instead, you break down these complex skills into very small um, pieces, and you teach them one at a time with prompting, and then you fade out your prompting, and a lot of liberal use of all kinds of different rewards or reinforcers. And it's really amazing uh, how fast some children can learn given these uh, conditions.